I'm Hebel Jafil. I'm from Lebanon. I'm 28 years old. My dream is to make something for Lebanon, especially for the women's football. This mission I have to complete it in a very good way. Hibe Yafil is on the go with Bundesliga side Hoffenheim. With support from the German government, the young Lebanese woman has come from Beirut to rural southern Germany to do an internship. I'm the head coach for the Lebanese national team under 17, under 19. Also, I played for the first national team for um, about 14 years. But Yafil still had to overcome resistance. The Lebanese people, before like five years, six years, they say, oh, a girl is playing football. No, it's for men, this, uh, this game. Now Yafil is hoping to shape the future of football in her country. She wants to share her experience and knowledge with other women in Lebanon who are just as crazy about the sport as she is. We need to show the Lebanese, the Arab countries, the, all the world that we women can do anything in this domain. Yafil's persistence and ambition make her someone very unusual in Lebanon. When the Federation, Lebanese Federation, gave me the, allowed me to, to, to take the coach the under 17 or the under 19 national team, I listened from the most of men coaches in Lebanon that, oh, why this, this girl, a girl should coach the national team? Why be, we have a lot of coaches, men, so we can coach the national team? But Yafil refused to be deterred and went on to coach the Lebanese under-17 and under-19 women's squads. Her aim is to forge a strong adult women's national team. In February 2015, her team won the Arab under-17 Women's Cup. It was Lebanon's first international football title. was very good. The president for the federation was in the uh, airport waiting us. Mm, uh, a lot of fans was there, media, or everything was in the airport. And um, uh, it was really for us a huge dream. We don't have to stop here. We have to continue because this national team, if we, if we work on like four, five years, we will be better than the national team before that where I was playing. She hopes that her internship in Hoffenheim will yield new perspectives, techniques, and approaches. I need to, to improve myself because I took the C and the B, the A license. If you take the certificate and you put it by aside, it's not good. So you have to work on the field to, to get experience. I'm coming here not for tourists or not for like going out shopping and like this. I'm coming here. I have a mission and I have to, to, to complete this. Yafil sees herself not just as a coach, but as an ambassador for Lebanon. 3,000 kilometers from home, she's taking the train to Hoffenheim's practice ground. It's her last day of internship. Hi. <laughs> How, How are you? Doing? Good. Yeah, I'm fine. How are you? The club takes women's football very seriously. Hoffenheim's under-17 women's team has everything it needs for optimal training. So it was the perfect spot for Jafil to soak up new ideas. In terms of infrastructure, things here are tip-top. Hiba has been here for four weeks and we've had a nice time together. We communicated very well, even though we spoke English. I got a bit of insight into what Lebanon is like. Everything that happened both on and off the practice grounds was very enriching. There was a lot of mutual respect. It was absolutely positive. For me, it was a very, very good experience. 
uh, and this is the main thing that we have to work on in Lebanon that to work with the small children like seven eight years old we have to start with the girls from this age because this is the basic for development for women's football and I hope you you will be in the German national team and we'll see you later yeah thank you. okay thank you so much and goodbye Bye. 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 <laughs>